Good morning, everybody. My name is Old School Nerd. And I'm supposed to be doing a reaction to a brand new band that Timo uh, Bonner uh, shared with me and said, hey, check out this new band. Just finished their first single, their first video, and I would love for you to do a reaction. And I was like, absolutely. Any member of that close-knit uh, Central um, European uh, metalcore creative uh, metal community that's coming out, those young bands, I'm in. And, um, but before we do that, I just want to say, um, never met the guy, but I'm tearing up. To, uh, to Yannick, to his family, to Avalanche Effect, thank you for blessing us with your music, with your strength. Uh, with your fight, um, I don't think hardly any of us knew as we were doing reactions and enjoying Avalanche Effects music that even in a shot like this, you were in the fight of your life. And this week, Avalanche and the amazing metal community in Germany lost Yannick to cancer. And um, I've been thinking about it a few days, and I was watching uh, Avalanche Effects videos, and um, now you look back on it, and you're like, oh my god, how did he do all that while fighting cancer? And you realize you can't answer that. But on the positive light, sir, your music will live forever, and it will continue to touch people, even though you're gone. And with that... Let's get to business. Okay. I just want to dedicate this one to Yannick. To Yannick. I'm sorry. Excuse me. Okay. Let's get started with this reaction. All right. So the name of the band. Oof. Still, still tearing up. Let's get back. Let's get back. <clears throat> come on. With endings come new beginnings. And this is how it starts. The name of the band is Incomplete. Now, there's no O in the name, so it's in, it's like the word incomplete, but without the O. So the, even the title of the band is incomplete, get it? Now, the, the name of this song is Define Me. Now, just to give you an idea of how new this situation is, they have 103 subscribers on YouTube. 104 subscribers on YouTube. Their song was released one day ago. It has already 1600 uh, viewers. Now, I know for a fact that when the song came out yesterday and um, Timo shared the link for the video, they had 21 subscribers. So they've already picked up over 80 subscribers and just since their video came out. I know it's gonna go a lot faster. I don't know anything about the band other than Timo said, this is their first one. They worked really hard. Can you do it? And I went, absolutely. How can I not? So. With the passing of friends, we welcome new ones. All right, this is Define Me from Incomplete. My name is Old School Nerd, and don't worry, I'll have all of this band's information in the description below. Please check them out. There was uh, no chance to, uh, there really wasn't a chance to 
to come off the course. They go uh, off the ver course. They come right into the second verse. So there was no pause for me to even stop it. Uh, a couple things. Uh, definitely, a, you could definitely feel the influence of where they're from. The group of musicians and artists that they surround them with. Uh, that whole uh, community of metal bands has a tendency that when they come in, even if it's their first single, their first video, their first whatever, it's going to be well done. Um, uh, a lot of the amazing people like Timo and, and, and I know a few other people like Chris and, and there's a few other people um, in that community that really help each other out. And they won't let even a new band go out there half-assed. They're like, you're going to come in here and you're going to represent our community and our friends and fellow bands of this area. We're going to make sure your stuff's right before you walk out the door. And I think that's pretty cool. Um, first impressions. The voice is, is interesting. Uh, the look of the singer. And I don't know why I cannot get this out of my head. He, uh, he reminds me of the guy from Deadliest Catch, Jake Anderson. Remember the, the deckhand on the Northwestern who became the captain of the saga, right? He looks just like him. So I, I, when I saw him, I'm like, what the hell is Jake Anderson doing singing in a German band? But hey, at this point, who knows? Um, anyway, so we're going to back it up at the end of that course. I'm really digging the feel of it. Um, I, I'm, it, it feels a lot like an initial offering from a band where they're not pushing too far into the experimental, too much into the, um, into the progressive forms of the metal chord that you see in this, this genre, in this area of Europe where the creativity is definitely there. Um, because I know the bands that they associate themselves are very creative and very out of the box. But if it's your initial audio, uh, if it's just your initial offering, yeah, you try to do something that casts a pretty wide net so people can enjoy. So um, I'm enjoying for what this is, um, and I'm not going to define them, even though the song says define me. I think I'm going to let them do that uh, in time. Uh, my favorite part about this whole situation is we're going to enjoy this together. Now you have to ask your question, what's the next song? What do they do different on the next one? And then the next, I'm noticing bands like Hostage, Our Mirage, Torrential Rain, Avalanche Effect. All these different bands come out of this area, this zone in Europe. Hungry, young, exciting, dynamic musicians that are like, the only way we're going to make our mark, we don't have a major label pushing us here. We don't have a major label doing this or that or promoter or distributor, all this other stuff. To make our, our audience uh, appreciate what we do, we have to be creative. And we gotta make our fans one at a time, one show at a time. So I'm interested to see what this, what this band does next. I'm gonna give this video its props, guys. I like what you're doing, but listen to me. If you look at a band like Hostage, who put out Hostage, okay? Their album last year, Memento Mori, was in my top 10 of the year worldwide. That includes Lorna Shore, Bloody Wood, like, Electric Cowboy, Power Wolf, all these mega bands that put out huge albums, Memento Mori was in the top 10. And that's one of you guys, okay? So believe me, I wanna see what you do next. I wanna see how hungry you are. I wanna see how you develop because there's plenty of room in this musical family, especially in the old school nerd community. All, all, my, all my community members will tell you, we are almost 80,000 subscribers strong on YouTube because we all want to see and feel and hear and experience amazing, good music. And most of it comes from up and coming bands. So make your fucking mark. Go for it. That's my only advice. Cause you got everything else. Go for it.
mal die Haare hören. Somebody get a Ryan Reacts on the line right now. Hold on. Hold on. Let me get a Ryan Reacts on the line. All right, hold on. Let me put out the Orion Black signal. I don't know if I got, let me see. The Orion Black signal. You got a black. Orion, did you see? I'm a, okay. All right, I'm sending that one to Orion. I, I told him I, I, I told him I keep a, uh, an eye out for the black. Well, if, if, look, for those who don't know, Orion Reacts is the king of the black. Okay, down break. Uh, his entire channel is way beyond mine. Uh, Metal Burb and I are like, dude, did you see Orion's channel? Yeah, he's taking that blat thing over the top. He's outstanding. Um, uh, Orion, you're gonna like these guys. <laughs> they put it in there for you. Let's do it. Let's do it again. Let's go. Let's go. I, I really enjoyed that. Um, I think my favorite part, um, of course, you know, the the blat drop in is is not my favorite thing, but it's so many people's favorite thing. For me, it's about arrangement, musicianship, storytelling, and outstanding performance. Um, great vocals on the power end. Um, uh, very, um, very uh, vulnerable, almost to a. Uh, I don't want to say whiny, but I'm going to say vulnerable. Uh, vulnerable vocals during the verse, um, a devil may care, raspy uh, chorus with a lot of power and passion, um, just laying it all out there. And that you can really feel it go through. Band's tight. Uh, arrangement is smart. I'm liking it. I'm digging it. It's a good offering. Good. Welcome to the game, gentlemen. Uh, that's incomplete with Define Me. My name is Old School Nerd. Um, and of course, again, uh, to the to the to the members of and family and friends of Avalanche Effect, we are so sorry for your loss. And um, with chapters that close, new chapters open, and blessings upon all of you and all all of the amazing metal community over there in Germany. Uh, you guys really are a community and family that's pretty close knit. So you guys have all felt that. Um, and with that, um, I want to say thank you to Timo Bonner for requesting this. Um, outstanding, of course. If Timo requests something. How's it not gonna suck? It's not gonna suck, right? It's, you know it's gonna be good if he was requesting it. So um, we heard you and I cannot wait to see what comes of this band next. So uh, please check them out. I have all of their information description below. I know they got more stuff coming. I mean, they can't be this good on the first offering and not have more coming. Um, interested to see what, uh, what's next on their list. And with that, I wanna say thank you all so much and I want everyone to have a wonderful, wonderful up and coming artist Saturday. We'll see you later. Thanks for watching everybody. If you enjoyed this video, give us a like. It really helps the channel grow. Also, if you want to subscribe, right there. Big thank you to all my Patreons out there. We appreciate everything you do. If you want more content like this video, check them out above. Remember, love one another, take care of each other. We're all stuck on this mud ball together. We'll see you later.